Hello and welcome to another reading from the book, Our High Calling, a Daily Devotional. Today's reading is entitled, Let Jesus Lead, February 1st. He leadeth me, O blessed thought, O words with heavenly comfort fraught. Whate'er I do, where'er I be, still tis God's hand that leadeth me. He leadeth me, he leadeth me, by his own hand he leadeth me. His faithful follower I would be, for by his hand he leadeth me. Let Jesus lead. Jesus saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. John fourteen six. O oh, that we who are pilgrims and strangers in this foreign country might comprehend Christ the way, the truth, and the life. He says, No man cometh unto the Father but by me. The path he has marked out is so plain and distinct that the veriest sinner, loaded with guilt, need not miss his way. No one trembling seeker need fail of finding the true path and of walking in pure and holy light, for Jesus leads the way. The path is so narrow, so holy, that sin cannot be tolerated therein, yet access to the path has been made for all and not one desponding, doubting, trembling soul needs to say, God cares not for me. Every soul is precious in his sight. When Satan was triumphing as the prince of this world, when he claimed the world as his kingdom, when we were all marred and corrupted with sin, God sent his messenger from heaven, even his only begotten son, to proclaim to all the inhabitants of the world, I have found a ransom, I have made a way of escape for all the perishing. I have your emancipation papers provided for you, sealed by the Lord of heaven and earth. It is not because there is any flaw in the title which has been purchased for you that you do not accept it. It is not because the mercy, the grace, the love of the Father and the Son is not ample and has not been freely bestowed that you do not rejoice in pardoning love. If you are lost, it will be because you will not come unto Christ that you might have life. God waits to bestow the blessings of forgiveness of sins, of pardon for iniquity, of the gift of righteousness upon all who believe in his love and accept of his salvation. Christ is ready to say to the repenting sinner, Behold, I have caused thine iniquity to pass from thee. Zechariah 3, 4 through 7 Christ is the connecting link between God and man. The blood of Jesus Christ 
is the eloquent plea that speaks in behalf of sinners. Lord, I would clasp my hand in a thine, nor ever murmur, nor repine. Content whatever lot I see, since tis my God that leadeth me. He leadeth me, he leadeth me, by his own hand he leadeth me. His faithful follower I would be, for by his hand he leadeth me. Thank you for joining me today and be sure to join me tomorrow for another reading from the book Our High Calling. Please continue to have a wonderful day and God bless you.